Hi everyone, welcome back. Thanks for joining me again this week. My name's Alicia. Today we're celebrating Palm Sunday. Palm Sunday is also called Passion Sunday and it marks the beginning of Holy Week. It is the most important week in the church. During this week, we prepare ourselves for Easter by thinking about the events of Jesus' passion and death. In the gospel today, we hear the passion being read. It's a longer reading, so I've added a video of it for you to listen to with your families. You can also listen to it during Mass or on our live stream Palm Sunday Mass. In the country where Jesus lived, palm trees were everywhere. The branches of the palm tree symbolized victory and joy. During the time of Jesus, people used to wave palm branches as they cheered in celebration when important people, such as kings, would be walking through the streets of their town. On the Sunday before he was crucified, Jesus rode through the cities and the streets of Jerusalem on the back of a small donkey. The people were very excited to see him and waved palm branches and shouted and cheered. They shouted, Hosanna, to praise him. They were all very excited to see Jesus coming into their town. Later in the week, some of these same people who were so excited to celebrate Jesus' arrival into their town would want him crucified. This week is called Holy Week. At the end of this week, we will remember Jesus' Last Supper, his death on the cross, and his resurrection. When Jesus died on the cross, he forgave all of our sins. On Holy Thursday, we celebrate the day that Jesus washed the feet of his disciples and ate the Last Supper with them. This was the celebration of the first Eucharist that we still celebrate each time we have Mass together. He also made his disciples all priests by giving him them the power to turn the bread and wine into the body and blood of Christ. On Good Friday, we remember the suffering and the death of Jesus. He was hurt and made fun of. He had to carry a heavy cross through the streets. On Good Friday, Jesus died for all of us to erase all our sins. On Holy Saturday, we remember the day that Mary and the disciples were so, so very sad because Jesus was dead and buried in the tomb. They did not yet understand that Jesus was going to rise from the dead on Easter Sunday. On Easter Sunday, we celebrate Jesus rising from the dead. It's a very, very happy day that we will talk more about Easter Sunday next week. This week, I made this craft so that I could remember each of the days of Holy Week. I made the title Holy Week, and I labeled So Palm Sunday, which is the first day of Holy Week, I made some palm branches. For Holy Thursday, I made a loaf of bread and a chalice to represent the first Eucharist that we are celebrated and the Last Supper that Jesus celebrated with his disciples. For Good Friday, I made a cross to remember how Jesus died on the cross for us all. For Holy Saturday, I made a tomb with the stone rolled in front of it to represent Jesus being dead and buried in the tomb. And for Easter Sunday, I made a sun coming out from the clouds and it says, He is risen to celebrate. I'm going to hang that up on my wall this week so that me and my family can look at it and remember all the important days for this most important week in the church. I hope you all have a great week. I'll see you next week on Easter Sunday. Bye.